This is a trimming and installation tutorial for universal tablet screen protectors from Green Onion Supply. Part 2 of 3. Installing your screen protector. We recommend that you watch the techniques first before you try to perform them yourself. Please note these two warnings. As with part 1, you'll need the contents of your screen protector package, as well as the materials listed here. Step 4. Installation. It's time to install the protector. Start by cleaning the screen entirely. Clean with a damp part of the cloth to get rid of smudges and stains, then clean with a dry portion to dry the screen and remove any dust or streaking. Check with a lamp or flashlight and clean up anything that you find. Now, peel the clear dust isolation sheet off of its yellow paper backing. Then, stick it onto the screen and cover it completely. Push out the bigger air bubbles that form to help grab any remaining dust. Partially peel one edge of the dust isolation sheet up from one edge of the screen. We recommend a side that has a hole or slot for a button or webcam. Use the peeled up flap to form a tight scroll that sticks to itself. Don't remove it entirely. Instead, just roll the scroll back to expose a few inches of the screen. Now, you can peel the transparent yellow masking layer off of the screen protector and set it aside. Follow up by partially peeling off a few inches of the screen protector's grid printed backing from the same edge that was exposed on the screen. Fold the backing against itself. Align the matched edges of the screen and screen protector, making sure that any holes line up with any camera or webcam that they were trimmed for. Once everything looks alright, allow them to attach. Alternate between scrolling up the dust isolation sheet and peeling off more of the screen protector's backing as the screen and screen protector continue to attach to each other. If you get any larger bubbles, you can partially separate the screen and screen protector and then smooth them down as they reattach to get rid of the bubbles. Continue this process until the dust isolation sheet is off of your screen and the screen protector is fully installed. You can then save the dust isolation sheet. Next, part 3 of 3, fixing bubble issues with your installed universal screen protector. 